Megan, I am so excited about this. I'm so excited. Because today, you know what dish we're cooking? No. It is Mr. Burton salmon. Who, who is Mr. Burton? Burton is my uncle, Uncle yes. Burton. He is from Trinidad and Tobago. Okay, so any good dish, what's happening here on Top Chef Family Style, right? Yes. We're asking all the chefs to really dig from within, their family, their story. So when I had the opportunity to think about this dish for you, I thought about, you just had a baby. Who got you into music? Was your dad and Mr. Burton, and Burton right? Burton, yeah. So both of these things combined. I want to do something today that is both healthy, delicious, and bring back some memories. And hopefully, yes. you're going to taste something you never tasted before. OK. Got it? I'm so excited. OK, Burton's where's Mr. Love Burton this. when I need him? Where's he at? Where's right? he at? I wish he was here. Where is he? <laughs> so anyway, we're going to start with salmon. OK. So we're just going to sear it. And before we sear, we're just going to season it with a little bit of salt. Wow, you're so far away. And when you season with salt, you want to go from high up, right? Okay. So it evens out, right? Wow. And then we're just going to cook it mostly on the skin side. Okay. Smell the salmon, and it doesn't smell anything. Like any good fish, it should be odorless. Odorless. Right? So when you get your fish from your fishmonger or your guy, okay. you should ask for sushi quality of fish, grade A. Look at this it. quality of fish, grade A. You're going to lower this maybe just a little bit. I'm just going to sear it on the skin side, right? As that's cooking away. So Burton has, has roots in Trinidad, right? Yes. So we're going to glaze this with tamarind and soy. Okay. And tamarind is something that you find a lot in Trinidad. And yes. I thought that would be fun to put that glaze, you know, that fits your family, right? Love it. Also, you need to eat, you're on, you're on stage, you're in front of millions of people. Someone told me she has 12 million followers on <laughs> IG. I think I was the 12 million follower. Yes, it was yes, you. it was me. So I wanted you to eat something healthy, but also delicious. We're just gonna lower this guy down a little bit. So in this pan, you got salmon, olive oil, and a little bit of butter. Okay. The blend between olive oil and butter is key because we want the skin crispy. That's what the oil is there for. And then for that nutty flavor we want, that's when the butter comes in. Ah. So we need a mix between butter and oil, okay? Again, we're only cooking on skin side. So we wanted something healthy and delicious. This is yes, farro. Please. Farro is used a lot in Mediterranean cooking, super healthy. Okay. It's one of the oldest grains in the world, right? But farro by itself is not that delicious, right? Can you add some olive oil to that? Me? Yes. Oh, Go ahead. No. Yeah, 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 yeah. You got it, you got what it. You got it. When do I stop? Good, a little bit more. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah, you <laughs> okay. And then, remember, it's great food. Remember this, right? Great yeah. food. This is what I talk to the chefs about all the time. We can all taste the same thing sweet, salt, sour, bitter, heat, and umame. And this dish has all of those elements. The other way we decide on how we eat is aesthetic, right? If it doesn't yes. look pleasing, we don't like it. Looks. Texture. Texture. Right? If the texture is not funky and fun, it's mm -hmm. not going to taste fun. And then, of course, fragrance. If something doesn't smell, if that salmon doesn't smell great, we're not eating it at we're all. We're not going right? to eat it. So, all right, so the, the farro is here, right? It has one level of texture, right? We're gonna add in some fresh herbs. Why don't you just add in some fresh herbs? A little bit. Go ahead. Mm. Go ahead. Okay, just a little bit like Just a this. little bit more. Come on, be aggressive with it. Uh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> and then, go ahead. And then I'm gonna add in some, because we wanted this to be delicious and healthy. Okay. Tomatoes, peas. Wow. A little bit of cucumber. This Love like, that, so fresh. Yes, and that's the key, right? We wanna eat food that is both delicious, good for us, but also super, super healthy, right? Yes. We got this. Chef, can you squeeze in some of the, a little bit of the lemon juice? Yes, you I can, Chef. Juice, right? Yes. Awesome. You're doing good. Like that? Yes, oh absolutely. Oh my God, I'm going to make this at home. We're going to stir this up a little bit more. Now I'm going to turn up the heat a little bit. So we're cooking this. Do you see the skin? It's just cooking on the skin side. So yes, just the skin side only? Yes, skin side only. And then uh -oh. we flip it. Okay. Uh -oh. I've been doing that wrong. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> Okay, so we're going to toss that a little bit more. Okay. And then, talk to, you can toss that while I'm starting to plate slowly. Tossing. Right? Yes. So this is all about developing flavors that are delicious and layers of flavors, right? So. Yes. Look at this. Got two beautiful plates. Yes, you're doing good. 
<laughs> I can mix it. You see the peas in there? Yes. I got some beautiful pea puree right here for you. Pea puree. Yes. And we're just going to go confident like that, a swoosh. Ooh. A beautiful, elegant swoosh. I've never swoosh. seen anybody do that. Just a beautiful swoosh like that. Right? Art. And then... Oh, you're making it for two. Just fancy. <laughs> just right? fancy. Just like that. Wow. We know Uncle Burton's coming. So, yeah. <laughs> would he like this dish? Yeah, he would freak out. So tell me, tell me something about him. Did he teach you about how to play an instrument or sing? Yeah, What's Uncle this? Burton taught me because he, um, he's a he was a soca star. When I was like oh, seven wow. years old, he was like what? a musician, and he he would come to our house and show us his music videos. Yes. And I was like, I'm still his number one fan. Yes. And so I was like, I want to be a superstar. I want to have music videos. Yes. And. A lot of my music, people don't know, it has soca in it. It does. Like Your a music little has secret, so many layers. Yeah, yes. Soca music. But just like this, it's, it's layers, right. right? It's not just one thing, right? He's going to love this. So <laughs> did you ever, I have to ask you, this is like the multi-million dollar question, did you ever go to Trinidad to one of those carnivals? I did, but I was too young. That is one of it's those life goals, I want to right? go to carnival one day. And one day you're going to perform at carnival. Just come oh. back and do a little soca. Okay, look at that, right? That's Gorgeous so far. Yeah, there's plating. Yeah. So now we're going to flip the salmon. So this is a fish spatula, right? Oh. So we're just going to use the fish spatula and just and just just turn it a little bit. Very simple. It's like that. Look at skin. The skin got really nice wow. and crispy. Do you even know how long that was? That's about five minutes, maybe. You're just guessing? Yeah, I feel it. I can feel it. You can feel it. And now, we're just going to let that sit. So that's just cooking away, just like that. Remember this glaze, because it's all about Bert? Oh, yes. Now is the time to glaze it. Wow. This has tamarind. This has a little bit of soy, ginger. Ooh, yum. Yes. And then I did a broth. Because we wanted to keep it light. You gotta taste this first. This is the broth. And I was like, I want, because you learned a lot. You come a long way. You came to this show and you were super curious about food. Yes. And you've had sea urchin, you've had all kinds of food. This is I've no sea learning. urchin in here. Okay, good. No sea urchin here. This is just citrus. Is it turmeric? A little bit of turmeric, yes. Look at you, know my recipe. <laughs> if I find this on <laughs> megantrainer.com, you know where it came from. I'm just telling yes. everybody here. Witness <laughs> it. So taste that. This is an orange. This is a citrus broth. Where are you going to put the broth? On the plate. <laughs> that might be the question of the day. Oh, wow. Wow. Building it, right? Layers. That's butter, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. so just a little bit of butter, just like, you know. That tastes like toasted, like buttered toast. <laughs> so we want to do a light dish, but still super elegant. And fun and oh, wow. hearty. That's so flavorful. Right? So we have talked about the texture from the farro, from the green pea, celebrating the farmer's market, right? And then, of course, I'm gonna put the salmon on top. Wow, the plating! The plating. It's so colorful. We talk about always aesthetic, right? Texture. All Sorry. in here. Is this when you say let it rest? What? what? I'm learning. Wow, let it rest. That was good. That was really good. That was really, <laughs> really good. I love that. So she's right. It should rest a little bit longer. I'm just going to put that up like that. Oh, you put it on the mountain. Mm hmm. This looks Trinidadian, this plate. <laughs> it looks oh, it so It could be cool. from Nantucket, too. I'm super excited about this plate. And just because we can, we're just going to garnish with some fresh herb, a little bit of cilantro, a little, little stuff. Garnish. Just yeah. a little oh, bit. wow. Yeah. I thought those were plants. <laughs> <laughs> I thought they that were is so decorations. Good. That is so good. Yeah, they're plants. They're plants, girl. They're, they're, yeah. They're plants. Right? Gorgeous. Gorgeous. Do you think Bert would be happy? So, yeah, he, he'd be blown away. Nice. So, Megan, this and is our finish. gift from all of us here at Top Chef Family Staff. Some For you, <laughs> Uncle Bert salmon with a citrus broth and a beautiful farro tomato salad. Wow! I'm Ooh. so impressed. I mean, I know you're good, but like, wow. Okay, let's do it. All right, but uh, how would you do Just it? Jump in. Just get in. The mm. flavors in the salad. Yeah. Oh. Mmm. 
Nimpo, but delicious. Wow. It tastes like a good, healthy. Mm-hmm. But delicious. You know? Well, thank you, Chef Marcus, for blowing Wait, my mind. What are you mind. talking about? <laughs> it was fun. This was... I learned so much. And it was fun. That's and it, it was fun. That's it. That's all And it matters. was tasty. Yes. Burton, where you at? Burton. <laughs>